everybody. Happy Monday. Hope you're having an amazing start to your week so far. We are back with the total body turn up. I am so excited. Took a couple weeks off from teaching some classes with live here, but must reintroduce myself. My name is Nikki Pepper at Salt and Pepper. You can find my name right in the comments here. So I'm just gonna put a little comment so everyone knows what's going on. Hope you guys are ready for a good one because this is going to be the best start to your Monday you've had in a minute. Oh, we got Chrissy in the house. Let's go. So we already know it's gonna be so turned up. We got Coach Joe. He's gonna be hanging out with us as well. Yes. So guys, I'm gonna give you a little preview of our class as we're getting started here. What you're going to need is a pair of dumbbells, something medium, if you have one for lower, one for upper, that's great too. Otherwise, just a nice medium set of weights. You're gonna need a mat or just something you can lay down on. For our workout today, this is going to be a total body workout, a little combination of some strength and HIIT training, going to be amazing. So as always, I will be providing some lower impact alternatives so everyone, oh, we got Val in the house. Never miss a Monday. We got all the boss babes on this. So it's also, guys, it is International Women's Day. So I just like shout out all my strong females, my fierce females, showing up for you, showing up for yourself. Our format for class, we're going to be doing three different circuits. Each of those circuits will consist of four exercises. For round number one, we're going to perform each thing for one minute each, and round number two, just 30 seconds. I'll always give you a heads up as to what's coming up next, and we have three circuits in total. So we got no time to waste. Make sure you got your dumbbells, yes, ready to rock. And as always, I am rocking my outfit from live. So if you guys love this outfit, would love to match with my fellow fierce females here, you can use the code PEPPER20. I'm gonna put that in the caption of this video. Well, let's go ahead and kick it on up, spread on out. We got some work to do, everyone. First things first, we're gonna start with some leg swings up and across, just opening up this hip. If you guys are just hopping on, we're getting started with our warm up. so just join on in here. We're gonna get one last leg swing and we're gonna switch it out to the other side, up and across here. Just open up that hip. I love this little combination, a little strength, a little hit, everything you need. We're gonna tap our heel, reach down, pull that toe towards your shin, sending those hips to the back of the room. Great way to stretch after the weekend, definitely getting our bodies ready to rock. We'll get last pull up on that toe. Next one, we're gonna crisscross our legs and reach towards the back foot. Couple bounces at the bottom here, stretching out that lower back. Stand it on up and crisscross other side. Reach towards that back foot. Nice and gentle, stretch out that back. Beautiful. Stand it up, we're gonna get in some alternating knee hugs. Take that leg and pull it in towards the chest, hugging it in nice and close. Open up these hips, these hips still alive. We're gonna get one more on each side here. And last one. Next up, continue to grab that leg. We're gonna grab the outside of the shin and continue to pull it up towards the chest, getting into the sides of the glutes, into those hips. We'll get three reps on each side. Try to keep that shin parallel with the floor. Last one. Next up, our quad stretch. One arm up, grab your foot, pull your heel to your butt, keeping those knees nice and close. And I see lots of people hopping on, so definitely jump on in wherever we're at. We're just getting started. Again, this Monday morning party. We got last quad stretch. Let's bring those legs wide to the side. Reach down and touch that opposite toe. Nice stretch for the inner thighs. You might feel a couple cracks through the hips. That always feels nice. I just felt that. There we go. So I'm gonna do the warm up. We got last one. Now we're gonna come on down into our high plank. You can step it back. World's greatest stretch. Step one foot through. Lift the hand closest to the leg. Big twist. Replace the hand. Step it back and switch. Exhale, big twist towards that leg. Oh, I feel it so good. We got just one more step on each side here. Twist, twist, twist. And our final step through. Beautiful. Now we're going to stand it on up, inchworm back up to the top. We're going to do a big reverse lunge. Step it back. Let that back knee touch the floor. Exhale, lift the chest tall. One of my favorites, really getting into the front here of these hips. If you've been working from home, definitely a good one to start your day as you've been sitting at that desk. Hopefully you've got a standing desk by now. And we'll take one more big step back. Beautiful. Now let's release any tension from the upper back here. Let's pull our fingertips towards the floor and gently tilt that head side to side. Reach those fingers towards the ground, wake up that neck. One last one there. Just a couple 
more for our warm up. We reach that shoulder up and back. Nice slow circles behind. Let's reverse directions, couple circles forwards. And take your time on these. Keep that elbow straight. And switch it out to the other side. Reach it up and back. Good. Let's reverse directions, couple circles forwards. Nice. Let's get a couple more for this warm up. Some shoulder rolls. Flip the shoulder forward, palm up. And reach those fingertips apart. Flip that arm and switch. Big reach, big inhale. Open up that upper back. One more each side. Yes. Beautiful. Last one. Final one for our warm up. My personal favorite our side bends. Exhale, reach it on over. And make sure you got that mind right as well because it's not going to be an easy one with salt and pepper here. We don't mess around, we don't play. The original salt and pepper. We got last reach. Beautiful. All right, let's see who's on here, guys. Amazing. Make sure you got your dumbbells, your water, stay hydrated. All right, so I'm gonna show you your first four movements and then we are going to get right into it. So with my dumbbells here, just watching me first, grabbing our heavier weights. If we got two sets, we have a lower body. First exercise, we have one sumo squat into one sumo deadlift, folding up the waist for that second one. Exercise two, we got a split squat with a double pulse. I'm gonna show you from the side. One foot in front of the other, keep that knee behind the toe. Double pulse, we're gonna do 30 seconds on the left, 30 seconds on the right. After this, we're gonna be down on the ground, one dumbbell. We got a frog pup, here we go. So we're gonna be here, frog pup. And our last one, I always like to incorporate a little bit of hit. We're gonna get into a sprawler. We got two options here, keep you guys nice and safe. High plank, jump it through to a bottom of the squat. Low impact, we're gonna step it through, lift the chest and step it back. And Coach Joe is causing mayhem over there. He is knocking things off the counter, but that's okay. We're gonna start in 20 seconds. I'm gonna grab one last sip of caffeine because it's Monday, so let's go. All right, guys. We have one full minute sumo squat into that sumo deadlift. We're ready. Take your time on the first set. Still warming up these legs. Legs do it. Three. Two, one, here we go. First one, knees wide to the side, tall chest. Second one, send the hips back. Really targeting those inner thighs and right underneath the glutes. Definitely an area a lot of my ladies like to work on. We're getting that summer shred ready. We are ready, ladies. Celebrating International Women's Day with some strong females in the house. I know we got Val and Chrissy, two of my favorite boss days, showing up on a Monday. We never miss a Monday, guys. Let's go. We are halfway through, start to drop it a little bit lower. Most important thing, keeping those dumbbells nice and close to your body to protect that lower back. Nice tall chest, big squeeze at the top, shoulders tight and reach those dumbbells right between the shoelaces. We've got 15 more seconds here. On that deadlift, make sure that forehead is looking down towards the floor, hips back. Let's get one last deadlift and onto that split squat. Double pulse, double pulse, double the results. Here we go, I'm gonna show you from the side. Straight up, straight down. Double pulse, big drive up through that front foot. Think about squeezing the glute of the front leg on that double pulse. You're gonna feel glutes and quads here. Beautiful. Halfway through that first side. Notice how I'm staying vertical, straight up and down in my column. You can even see between my beautiful view and the window frames here, I am going straight up, straight down. Last rep here on the left. Switch it out quick on the transition, other side. Nice long stance. Is that front knee behind the toe? Are you driving through that front heel? Squeezing the front glute at the bottom. We want both the glutes and quads working. Woo! I don't know about you guys, but I'm feeling turned up already on this Monday. We'll get two more on this side. We're coming right down to that frog pump. Let's go. Pump that rump, ladies. Drop that dumbbell. Knees wide to the side. One full minute. We're gonna go relatively fast on these today. Most important thing with our frog pump and any glute bridge variation is tilting the pelvis towards you, then peeling up off the floor. We always wanna protect that lower back by keeping those hips tucked. Nice little compliment to our little sumo combination. Get right underneath these glutes and inner thighs. Beautiful, keep pumping it up. We're halfway through. Make sure you're breathing because we got that sprawler coming up. 
Remember, you've got that option to jump or step. Everyone's able to do this workout. Good, keep tilting and squeezing. I want those glutes squeezing as hard as you can at the top. Nice job, nice job. We got 10 seconds. Right up, right down. So good, ladies, come on. Make sure we're breathing. We got three, two, one. Dumbbell out of the way. High place roller, jump it up. Also, I'm gonna show you the option. You can step it up, lift the chest, step it down. Woo. Nice soft landings. One full minute of this roller is tough. But I know my Monday morning, ladies, you are tougher. You're showing up. First thing before starting your work week, you are motivated and you are feeling it. All right, lift that chest. Hands down. Soft landings with those feet. Core is tight. Stay nice and low in the bottom of that squat. Woo! I'm feeling this fire playlist too. And don't you get smacked up. Come on, we got 20 seconds. Keep those knees wide. Remember, round two is only 30 seconds. We gotta be quick on the transition back to our feet. I need two final sprawlers. Right down, right up. Yes. Come on, come on, last one. Good, grab those dumbbells. Woo. It's meant to be tough. One sumo squat. One sumo deadlift, yes. Woo. Make sure to breathe. How are we feeling after those sprawlers? I don't know about you. That was a tough one. Yes. Beautiful. Drop it one inch lower than you did. That first set, warm up round is over. We got 10 seconds to go. Tall chest, squeeze those glutes at the top. Yes. Last rep, split squat. Right into it. Only 15 seconds each. So I'm right down, big drive up, right back to the bottom. Yes. Woo, these quads are, quads are on fire. All right, you're on fire. That's what's up. Turn up, last rep, and switch, right down. Make sure we're still maintaining that form as we've up that intensity. You want to pick up that pace without losing the integrity, integrity and intensity, that's the goal. Last rep, come on, last minute, last minute. I know those legs are feeling it because I'm right here with you. Tilt and squeeze, right up, right down. Are you tilting those hips? Are you squeezing as hard as you can? If those glutes and legs aren't shaking, you're not squeezing hard enough. Get up, get up. You got 10 seconds. Come on, right up, right down. Keep those hips tilted so good. Five, four, three, two, final 30. Let's go. Right down. We are live with live. Feeling alive. All right. Come on, only 30 seconds on round two. The second you come up, those hands get right back to the floor. Yes. Come on, come on. 15. Second 15 is where we pick it up. One more notch. There we go, there we go. I know those inner thighs and claws. We're feeling it. Just for our targets, just what we're looking for. Three, two, time. Oh, my quads. Yes. All right, give me some love. If you're feeling better than when you started, give me some hearts. Yes. Love it. All right. All right. Through the roof right now. Take a minute. Grab some water. I'm going to show us our second circuit. So, we got upper body. You can tell I'm not faking it until I make it. Yeah, we're on fire. Val's on fire, that's for sure. Favorite boss days in the house. So, if you have a lighter pair of weights, grab a lighter pair. We got upper body. So, first one, watching me, we're going to do Nice little combination, bend over row, into a tricep kickback, forehead down, hips back, row, kick back, all the way down to the bottom. Take your time, try to show the end of each movement there. Row, kick back, row back down. After that, we're coming down to the ground. Love this combination as well. We have a floor press into a leg lower. Two options here. Option one, more advanced with me. Leg straight, floor press to leg lower. Option two, if you feel anything for that lower back, you're gonna bend those knees, do the same thing. Keep the lower back pressed into the floor. After that, we got some core and cardio, full combination here. We have a high plank, hook to the dumbbells over the way, into a single arm reach, two options as well. A more advanced option here, feet nice and wide. Reach that arm up to the ear, core and shoulders. Option two, you can come down to the knees, 
same thing. Keep those hips forward and tucked either way. Last one, we are doing a stay low burpee into a high plank jack. We'll look like this. So super efficient, we're already here. Burpee, jack the feet right back down. Low impact option. Still gonna roll it down, just go a little slower. Tap the foot, tap the foot. I'm gonna grab one more sip of water. I got a toe cramp, which is so fun. That's okay though, gonna push through. We're gonna start in 20 seconds. So one last little sip. Level it up. International Women's Day. Nothing stronger than my ladies. Here in the house, live is live, Monday morning. All right, let's get it. Feeling good, feeling fine. On to our bent over row. Bicep kickback, let's get it. Three, two, one, here we go. Forehead down, pull the weights back, lock up the elbows, back down. It's one little segmented movement. Row, squeeze the hands back, lock out the elbows, back to the row, back to the bottom. Contrary to what you see very often, slower is actually harder. So take your time on these. We're gonna get that high fast reps on the cardio portion. So really focus on squeezing the correct muscles here. Is that forehead down? Is your back flat? Are you pulling the hands up and back towards the pockets? And are those elbows locking all the way out in the back? Squeeze them. If it's feeling easy, add a two second pause. Trust me, that two second pause is gonna be double as challenging as going fast. Woo, we got 10 seconds, nice job. Make sure you're breathing, we got that floor press into the leg lower, super advanced one. So you can do straight legs or bent legs. Three, two, one, come on down. Shoulders pull back into the floor. Option one, we got straight legs, legs and arms. Lower and lift at the same time. If you feel that lower back, bend the legs, all good. We're here to keep you safe, keep you moving, feeling good. Nice. I know we got some advanced people in the house though, so I challenge you, if you can do it, do the straight leg lowers with that floor press. Everything is pressing to the floor, from your head, your shoulder blades, your lower back, moving and lowering at the same time. We got actually three core exercises back to back, because I know my ladies, we're getting ready for the summer shred. We got summer just around the corner, about three months away. And we're gonna come out of quarantine, looking quarantine, that's for sure. Just made that one up. There we go, we got 10 seconds into that high plank, single arm reach. Let's get it, let's get it. Three, two, one, right up. Feet wide, slow it down, take your time. Hips are level, reach that arm up to the ear. Yeah, let's go. If you guys are hopping in, if you're warmed up, feel free to jump on into this workout. Otherwise, you can catch the replay on live stage or my stage, either way. We're working, keep those hips tucked. Reach that arm up to the ear. It's gonna be one tough minute here. We're only, whew, we're only 25 seconds in, that's all good. Keep the belly button pulled in towards the spine. Keep it slow. I want those hips as level as you can. And try to replace the hand directly beneath the shoulder. It's gonna be an added challenge. Fight for it. I know those arms are feeling it. We got 15 seconds. We didn't show up on Monday morning for easy. We showed up for some results. And we're gonna deliver. We're into that burpee, the high plank jack, or lateral step in three, two, one. Roll it down, press it up, jack the feet, back down. Woo, feel that core fire up after that full minute plank. Most important thing here, soft legs with the knees, you don't wanna Jack up those knees on the high plank jack. Bend the knees as you jump. And control it down to the ground. You're gonna feel the shoulders fired up, the triceps fired up. And definitely that core. This is our third core exercise, back to back to back. Very strategically put together. We are fired up. 30 minutes, but you guys know, if you've taken my workouts before, the shorter they are, the harder they are, really. We gotta pack it all in, 20 more seconds. Try to keep that same pace. Coach Joe's coming in. Come here, Joe. It was his birthday yesterday, so he's being a little fresh. He's a toddler now. There we go, roll it on down. Jump it on up. Let's get a last rep here. Come on, I know that core's on fire. Woo, shake out those arms, come on. Officially past the halfway point. We got that bent over row to kick back. 
Just 30 seconds on round two. So I need you to focus on that quality form. I know you're feeling those triceps on that kickback. After those stay low burpees, oh yeah. Squeeze the shoulders tight. Make sure that forehead is looking at the ground. Don't look at me, look at the ground. Protect that neck. You got a work day ahead. Beautiful, we got five seconds. Last rep, squeeze. Come on down to the ground. Floor press to leg lower. Here we go. Take your time. I challenge you to do the straight leg one. Only 30 seconds. Draw the belly button in towards the spine and only go as low as you can without that lower back coming off the floor. 15 more seconds. Let tap those elbows. Exhale, squeeze up and in over the chest. We're getting toned triceps 21. Last rep here. Come on, ladies. Five. We got one minute to go. High plank, single arm reach. Keep those hips level, slow it down. It's that hand directly beneath the shoulder. Don't have it in front, right beneath you. That's gonna be even more challenging. Are those hips wiggling side to side? I know it's Instagram, but we gotta keep it tight, keep it centered. Stay that for later. We got 10 more seconds. Almost there into this burpee, the high plank jack. I need you to step it up one more notch for the last 30. In three, two, whoa, let's go. Right down, jack the feet right back. I'm pushing for you at home, so I need you to push for me too. So start with a very strong reek. So there's no one else I'd rather do it for. Come on. We got 15 seconds. It's International Women's Day. We gotta show the men, the ladies, what we are made of. Some fierce females, staying strong, pushing through. Let's get two more reps, come on. Last one, and time. Oh my triceps, oh my gosh. Oh, we have more people in the house. Hey everybody, definitely catch the replay if you were not on the original warm up here. Okay, I'm gonna catch my breath. Last one, full body. So, oh my goodness, here comes Coach Joe. So we got a couple options here. I'm gonna show you guys Exercise one, stay hydrated, grab a towel if you need it. Use a towel, sure. So, first one, super, super tough, but I know my Monday morning recruit year is tougher. We're going to do an alternating thruster, which is a squat, into an alternating overhead press. Exhale, drive it up. If you've got any shoulder stuff going on, you're just gonna do regular front squats. All good, skip the shoulders. We got more shoulders coming your way. Next one, we're going to do a hammer curl. There he is, there he is. We're gonna do a hammer curl into, there it goes, crazy coach. Hammer curl into a lateral raise. Definitely grab the lighter weight for these. Lighter weight for that thruster as well. So hammer curl, working the biceps, into a lateral raise, soft bend in those elbows. After that, we are really getting into our final two of our cardio portion. So we got two options here. Kind of a new one. It's a hop, like you're going up and over a fence into a high jump. So I'm here. Hop up and over, high jump. Hop up and over, high jump. Low impact, you're just gonna do a little side to side step, stay low hips back. Final movement, we got two options as well. A little higher impact, you're gonna do a crisscross kick. Feel the lower abs and shoulders. Low impact, same idea. Just crisscross those legs. So guys, we got Coach Joe in the house. He says, you're doing perfect and you got this. So we got the last set, let's go. <laughs> We're gonna start in five seconds, alternating thruster. Let's go, let's go, let's go. One minute, three, two, one. Let's work. Alternating every time we press. Send those hips down and back. Nice tall chest. If you've got any shoulder stuff going on, the injured shoulders, just do that front squat, go a little faster. These thrusters are really getting this heart rate up. Woo. Exhale, push that dumbbell up to the ceiling like you mean it. We are celebrating being some strong, fierce females, feeling good, looking even better. Amazing work. You ladies are already halfway through. Make sure you're keeping that tall chest. Dumbbell comes right back to that shoulder, so good. I know you're feeling those shoulders, but we're looking to get that nice shape, looking good in our open back dress, coming out of quarantine. Looking fine. Let's get one last rep on each. Last one. Take a second, take a deep breath. Gonna be a tough minute here, but we got it. One hammer curl 
into one lateral raise. Definitely use the lighter weights for these. I'm already feeling it. If you need to, take a second, take a deep breath, keep it going. I would rather you take the, you know, three to five seconds to rest than to try to push through and get hurt. So take your time, listen to your body, one curl, one lateral raise. Hell yeah, halfway, halfway. We got curls for the girls, guys for the guys. Feeling good, feeling fine. Make sure you're breathing because we got two minutes of straight cardio coming up. A little high intensity. They don't call it total body turn up or nothing. 15 more seconds. Make sure those hips are staying still. You are still as a statue, so good. Last five, four, three, two. Dumbbells way out of your way, don't trip. Up and over the fence, up and over, high jump. Low impact, you're just a new side to side step. You're still working just as hard. Up and over the fence, use those arms, jump it up. Nice soft landings, yes. I want ponytails flying through that ceiling, let's go. Up and over, just like track. Soft landings like a cat, like Coach Joe. <laughs> Come on, so good. He says my form is great. Thanks Joe, good work. So good. Up and over, hips back, explode through that floor. 30 seconds. Come on, the finisher is not meant to be easy. We are setting the tone for the day. Setting the tone for the rest of this week, rest of this month. Gonna be some March Madness coming your way. Woo! 15 seconds. Don't lose that quality form. If you lose that focus, you could roll an ankle. Stay focused with that intensity. We got three, two, one. Deep breath. Here we go. Come on. I know I am pushing for you guys. Core is tight. Low impact, you're gonna step it out. Whether you need to do the low impact to catch your breath, or because you get any knee stuff going on, either way, choose the option. It's gonna be good for you and your body. Come on, feel those shoulders, I know it. Definitely a tough combination. Those abs need to be so rock solid. If someone came and punched you in the belly, you would break their hand. Come on, lean it back, slight lean back. Lower abs, arms are horizontal, don't let them drop. Here we go. Woo! Those thrusters are not gonna be easy after this. We don't do easy, guys. Come on. We got 10. Stay with me. Almost there. Five, four, three, two, and up. <laughs> On to that alternating thruster. Here we go. Final two minutes, right up, right down. I need you to push. I need you to dig deep. You didn't show up for easy. You came here with some goals in mind. So I know my Monday crew, so motivated, so fired up. Come on, 10 seconds, no rest. Two minutes, that's it. Right down, right up, big press. Three, two, one, boom, curl. To lateral raise, oh, breathe. Keep breathing. Exhale. Slow that heart rate down. Breathe into the nose. Out of the mouth. Right out to the side. Yes. Come on, fight through it. I'm right here with you. These shoulders are on fire. As I always say, where it's burning, it's working. You can feel the pump. You can see the pump. The pump, the pep, it's all here. We got a high jump up and over. Three, two, one. Dumbbells off to the side. Last minute, ladies, let's work, let's work. Right up, boom, pop it up, yes. Still maintain that control. Remember your why. When you're feeling tired and you feel like you wanna quit, what's your motivation on this Monday, International Women's Day? I love some strong ladies, come on. We got five seconds, four, three, two, last 30. Kick it up, kick it up, kick it up. Joe's going nuts. Come on, he's excited, we're excited. Feeling good, on this live, with live, with salt and pepper. Come on, final 15, even faster. How are you gonna set the tone for your Monday? Show me right here, right now. Five, four, three, two, and time. How are we doing? We're gonna do a quick cool down. 
I'm not faking it. That is real, not water. Okay, come on down. We're gonna start with a shoulder stretch. That has a lot on these shoulders. Come on down, thread the needle, reach one arm underneath and through. Press the shoulder into the floor and really expand this upper back. Don't think about what you got coming up next. You're good, you got time to shower before your Zoom meeting, don't worry. And then gently switch to the other side. I'm so proud of you guys for continuing to take this time for yourself. Everybody's got 30 minutes, so I know my boss babes on here are so busy, but they still made time. No excuses. Let's take a nice big lunge forward. Stretch out those hips before we sit down for the day. Hopefully you guys are feeling more energetic when you woke up. I know I already am pepped up for a very strong day ahead. Switch out to the other side, last stretch. Never skip the cool down, guys. It's only a couple minutes. We're gonna really feel that if you don't cool it down. Let's stand it on up. See how you feel. Give yourself a big flex, because you deserve it. You are amazing. Yes, Val is feeling it. I am like a hot pepper, chili pepper today. So guys, as always, thank you so much. I'm so grateful for you all. Yes, she's going into the meeting. Yep, she's like, I'm here. I got full face. So I just wanna show you guys my outfit. Love it, it's like sparkly. I showed, I tried it on the other day, live on Lincoln Road down here in Miami, but you guys can use the code PEPPER20. It's gonna be in the caption here, as well as my link, I'm gonna post on my stories. Would love to have you guys match me, and I'll see you here in two weeks. Same time, same place, baby. Let's go, everyone, and crush your week. You're amazing, love ya.